Hello and welcome back to Imperion Galactic Survival. My name is Spange. We're um, we're here at the abandoned drone base from the last episode. Uh, I've I've got a hundred and thirty or so rounds, hundred and forty rounds uh, on the assault rifle here. Another twenty in this one, and the shotgun with two hundred and something or other rounds. So I'm thinking the shotgun is going to be our weapon of choice, and hopefully get us through this nightmare <laughs> and into some decent loot. We've already picked up some reasonably decent bits uh, already so yeah, let's see what we can find. It's entirely possible that this base is going to kill me a lot. <laughs> oh nice medium armor I mean I've got a heavy on so chainsaw that's gonna be really handy on a lava planet. <laughs> And we already looted that one, didn't we? Let's have a look upstairs. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? You guys just stay there. You st that was insane. Uh, really? On the head. On the bloody head. That's just cheeky as. It's a good job we could. Is, <laughs> words. It's a good job he could attack me. Bloody hell! Bells. There's a bloody another one. Ow! Oh, reloading is not a good time for that. Good night. Oh, yeah, yeah. This base is going to be one of those, isn't it? It's going to be one of those. I'm going to need to change my underwear. I think, guys. A drill. <laughs> I mean, yes, that's, that's, that's exactly what I was hoping for, is a drill. Oh, boy. Why have I got... Um, oh, I know why I did that. Sorry. I've got 999 windows in there because I spawned in the brute again to take a thumbnail of it in the last episode. And it was missing a window. I think I figured out why it wasn't airtight. But then I also do still believe there is very much a bug with the whole airtightedness thing. So, But anyway, we're not here to talk about that. We're here to scare the crap out of me. <laughs> Can I have no more freaking bugs land on my face, please? That's the sort of vent where bugs come out of. Oh, wait, we got a, we got a sentry gun there. I don't even know if that thing actually works or not, still. Yeah. All right, it's one down. <laughs> God damn. God damn. <laughs> oh dear, right. Uh, God, I wish I could blow them up. I don't have any C4 um, or explosives. But I don't think they will respawn anymore. Not for a while, anyway. Oh, hopefully. They do them screwed. Okay. Weird. Weird. Oh, it's like a building sphincter. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we got some more um, pentaxid and stuff. That's good. A <laughs> laser drill. <laughs> Hell yes. This is why loot is so good. Loot is the best. A laser drill. Oh, we'll be mopping up those rocks in no time then in that case. We won't even need to loot this entire base. It's just a case of looting until you get that. <laughs> awesome. All right. What else we got? Back to the Orem Wood. Promethean packs. I like it. I like it. I don't like those noises. And this is where things get a bit dicey, I think. Oh, wow, the loot in this place is insane. The loot and the jump scares, man. It's all about... <laughs> 107 combat steel blocks. Well, I'm not going to use those, but I'll use the tool turret. Mmm, very nice. And a T2 multi-tool. Thank you, please. Um... That can replace my current multi-tool. Smashing. Take all of that. Bit of safe in there as well. 
Uh, I'll leave that. Um, the combat steel. Don't need it. TT multi tool. Lovely. If we're going to get some slightly better weapons, I'd be very happy. I think just know that there's going to be some horrors around this corner. We got some radiation build up. We got a sentry gun. Ugh, listen to it. Head angle. Fortunately, these um all these aliens and stuff, they seem to be like level one. Uh so they can actually be killed reasonably well. Oh trusty shotty. Bit like that. Ho oh. ho! <laughs> Bring it on, son. <laughs> I don't know. Any more bloody jump scares? Uh, I can't be scared anymore. I've literally I've reached the, the limit, I think, of having a goddamn bug jump on my face. There's nothing in here. Is there nothing in here? There's no loot things at the end, is there? No. You're nice to disassemble those generators. If I even need to by the end of this thing. I don't even know. Got some alien blocks coming up here. Ow. Ow. Swine. Alright. Let's have your red bug then. Come on. Nah, mate. Oh, okay. One of these vents is going to drop one, I just know it. <laughs> and by drop one, I mean a red bug, not a massive duty. Duty? Dookie. Dookie. Poop! Alright, we've got some, got some ammo stuffs. Up to 3,000 of our... Um, I'm hoping this thing can lift all the stuff. <laughs> looted to it. In fairness, I'm going to chuck a lot into the factory to get the nightshade in. Which I'm almost certainly... Uh, certain that we're going to be able to. I'm going to take those. That's all right. I'm going to have them upon my person. Again, I'm going to leave the blocks because we won't be able to carry those. I've got more guts and innards. There we go. Lovely. Ooh, it's a good day for loot, boys. It's a good day for loot. It's a bad day for jump scares. Um, which way did I come? I think I came that way, I think. We're down. We're going down. Okay. I remember in the normal uh, drone based version of this, there's a big guy in there. Are you going to have to. Whoa! Cheeky motherfucker. See that bastard? Properly went for it. Are they stuck now? Are they not gonna they're not gonna come and get me, are they? Okay, that guy just got deleted. And that guy got deleted. Good. God, they I forget how much damage these sons of bitches can do. Right, I'm hoping my hover tank can deal with that drone that's coming along. I can hear its turrets going for it. I'm gonna have to get back because it's only got a limited firing arc. As long as it doesn't, I, I, I can hear the thing taking damage. Come on, hover vessel, you can do it. I believe in you. You are the beast. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Keep firing, keep firing. Destroy that son of a bitch. How do I get out of this place? Oh, look at you, you beautiful boy. 
It's a big one. It's definitely a big one. Oh! Where's the other one? There he is, I see him. No, 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 no. I got ya. I got ya. You ain't getting me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Drifter, man. Beasting. I love it. Oh, I was so out of stamina. <laughs> out of stamina out of O2. Yeah, O2's fine. Alright. You took a few hits. I heard the, the, the tonks of armor being shot at. The cockpit got shot, but it's fine. Oh man, you beasted. You beasted those two drones. I love it. More of that, please. Wow. Oh, there's another one coming. Okay, let's loot this thing. Please don't be a plasma drone. Actually, please be a plasma drone. I can deal with a plasma drone. I've just got a plasma cannon. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to attach to the nightshade as soon as I get it, right? <laughs> Go away. Large minigun. Okay. I hope you've got ammo there, Drifter. My bud. My buddy, my dude. Jacka! Jacka, dagga, dagga, dagga. <laughs> now, where are these drones coming from? Big boys as well, aren't they? Alright, what you got for me? You are Gatlin as well. That's cool. Gatlin and a rail gun. Oh, I tell you what. I forgot I put like loads of stuff in this thing. Still mobile. Still very mobile. It's doing well. Alright. Back to it. <laughs> Any more drones coming? No, it doesn't look like it. Good. Whew. <laughs> Alright. Back to back to this place. Let's hope we don't have any more of these bugs drop on my face. I um go back to where we were. Okay, yes, we were in here, weren't we? Oh, hi! <laughs> Damn. Oh, hi. Deleted. He's been erased. Alright, we got some weird floaty blocks going on here. We got a switch there. I'm not entirely sure what that switch does. Um, in my experience, switching of switches in bases usually results in either opening of a door or the self-destructing of said base. <laughs> yes, we will see, but that is me out of, uh, almost out of rifle ammo. Uh, just a shotgun then. Uh, cool, cool, cool. Oh, hello, hello, cheeky. Oh, you're a big angry boy. Deleted. <laughs> Why do they just despawn like that? That's so funny. <laughs> Deleted. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, look at this stuff. We got a pulse rifle T2. Let's grab that. Uh, and that always freaks me out as well. And the bloody meteor shower. Let's flick that switch and see what it does. It's uh, can't be that bad, right? All right. Everything seems to be intact. Large O2 tank. Oh, God! Nope, nope. I'm pressing buttons. Nothing's happening. Ow! <laughs> just, just mashing the keyboard. <laughs> Why have I got this? Oh, yeah, I picked it up from my um, little foray with the uh, drones, didn't I? Get in there. There we go. Nice. Ventilator. Hello. Oh, hi. You. Oh, I don't want to go down there. That looks like a bad place. That looks like a bad place. Oh! Oh, you're going to start doing that on me, are you? Oh, I'm getting hot. It's 110 degrees down here for some reason. Um, okay, let's go around the other way. Ha <laughs> ha Epic heavy sniper. We've got sniper rounds. Mm, no, not really. This heat is going to be an issue, though. I'm not sure I could really 
Is it the heat of the um oh there we go. Oh no, there we go. No, we don't go. Where where is it where was it cold? Where was it cool? Ah, oh, it's cool here. There we go. Ah. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Nice little sci-fi donuts. I like sci-fi donuts. I mean, prefer real ones, but whatever. All right, so we've got the epic loot container, but there wasn't a core in there from what I could see. Just double check that a second. It's not above it. Nope. Okay, because that's where the core usually is. Okay, let's have a look down here then. I mean, let's have a look like sensibly. Get somewhere where it's not baking. Deploy the reconnaissance drone. Hello, God. Oh, my Lord. Okay. Okay, I've never seen this before. I've never been down here, actually. This place is baking down here. It's like hundred, hundreds of degrees. And there's the core. Well, I can do anything about it, and no doubt when I go down here, about a thousand horrors will probably spawn. Hmm. Definitely worth a little trip, though, isn't it? It's got to be. Even just to get that loot. Alright, let's cool off. Oh. Now, there are some blocks in this place, like this one, the curved one. <laughs> that's 22 degrees it's lovely it's lovely it's wonderful uh, and there are other blocks where it's not so accommodating god damn I am not in a position really to do this <laughs> oh boy okay I got another shotgun let's get that um All these assault rifles and stuff come with ammo, don't they? So let's grab them. They all come with the whole clip. So if we're going to use all the ammo we got available, then let's use all the ammo we got available, right? Don't need those two. Let's kit the other shotgun up. Let's see what you guys have got. You got a full clip. You got a full clip. You got half a clip. So you go back. You come in. You got a bit of a clip. All right. I'll use you two as the emergency backup. 13 rounds on that bad boy, 14 on this one. 28, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go get absolutely bum rushed. It's going to be hundreds of degrees down here. Alright, I don't know how I'm going to get back up there. With precision, precision jumping. Not even sure I can build. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I got an idea. Okay, one more try. Okay, he's up. He's up. He's up. He's up. Parkour, baby. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I can make it back up. Fine. Let's press on. Yeah. Right. Okay. <sighs> All right. How many horrors and stuff are going to be spawned? Like that. Come on, you little bitch. Shotgun for the win. Whew. A furnace, of course. A T wood generator. <laughs> Well, I can't take a furnace, I'm afraid. <laughs> um, what I can do is possibly chuck some of this in the factory. Oh, wait, yeah, no, there's no logistics link yet, is there? Oh, that's annoying. Oh, I wish there was a logistics link. Um, how are we doing? We're okay. We've got 267 on oxygen and five emergency O2 bottles. Eh, well, 15. Okay, should be all right. We should be alright. In that case, let's put some stuff on here and we can pump that into 
the factory. I think we might have a nightshade at the end of this, to be honest, guys. Boom. 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 Just the cobalt and the carbon substrate. Oh, so close. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully one of these containers has a bunch of cobalt in it. If not, we'll just have to go and mine some. It's fine. All right, next round of crazy critters to spawn. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'll have that on mine there, thank you. So you can go in there. Smashing. Absolutely smashing. Let's kill the core then. You ready for this? Hi! Oh, there's two of you little buggers. There's three of you little buggers. Four of you little buggers. All right. I underestimated you once. It will not be done again. You guys get stuck in doorways easily, huh? <laughs> Ow. Good job I didn't get a weird infection from that guy. Come on. Thank you. You got it. You got it. I tell you what. It's... Shotgun's great. These guys are only level 1. They were like level 5 or something. It would be a different bloody story, I tell you. But yeah, you smack him in the face with a shotgun then. It, 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 it works pretty well. I assume this is doing damage. Yeah, there we go. Oh, hi. <laughs> ah, another one. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Right, let's, let's, let's equip me some epicness. Um, Shodlamo. Okay. Whoop. I don't think I'll have any more trouble. But you can never be too careful. Right, that was definitely a spawner. What do you think that spawned? And what's the point of coming down here? There isn't one. Just the exploration. Probably another bunch of bugs. Anything in here? No, nope. just a triangle of death. All right, I'll head back to the uh, the, the HV. I'll craft a core, and then we can dismantle this place. I just need a little bit more cobalt, and we can get the nightshade in. All right, got a core. So let's just that doesn't really doesn't really matter. Let's just pop it there. There we go. Now we can. Uh, oh no, they took it away, didn't they? Um, well, they took away the alien ones. They've still got all the other ones, I suppose. But I'm pretty sure I looted everything on the way. And this is like anything that I missed, but I don't think so. Okay. Well, the good news is we can disassemble everything. Well, I've got a core now, so I could actually chuck the rest of this into the factory. <laughs> do you know what I want to do first, though? I want to attach a laser drill to the front of this beast. <laughs> oh, why not? <laughs> why not? <laughs> it's not sort of CV laser drill, is it? No, I'm just too close. Give me the laser drill. <laughs> is that weird? Let's uh, let's dig into it a little bit. Let's. Uh... Oh god, we got another, got another drone. Hang on, then. We got the, the weapon for this. Oh, you're not going to last very long, are you? I'll save my ammo. <laughs> uh, noob. Bong, 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 bong. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever. I have a laser drill. Just the one. Um, I do also now have a. Headlight bulb. Yep, 
Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Let's do that. It's literally a case of just finding enough cobalt in this place to build the nightshade. But I can't remember what takes or what gives cobalt still. Um, I'll start with things like fuel tanks and generators and stuff. Oxygen is precious, so I am going to take that oxygen. And that means I can now top up my oxygen in my hover vessel. All the way and still have enough to refill the tanks. Beautiful. Normally I wouldn't bother with these little ones, but because they contain oxygen and water and stuff like that, <laughs> they're pretty valuable now. <laughs> Oh yeah, look at all the cobalt we're getting from these fuel tanks. This is it. This is going to be it. This is what will do it. Let's see now. Is With that cobalt alloy, 105 of it, is that enough? Oh hell yeah it is. And somewhere along the way, I hit level 10. <laughs> I have no idea when that happened. I'm happy it did. Hell yeah! We're going to get there, guys. We are going to get there. We're going to escape this hellhole. Oh, yeah. And all it took was one POI. <laughs> As it should. As it should. If it took more than one POI, something's wrong, right? Um, there's generators in this one of these rooms. Here we go. Generator room. Give me all those parts. Give me all them parts. So you could probably get a CV out of looting this place quite easily. The only thing you might struggle with is a Neo. Um, and I think there is Neo on this planet. There's one deposit of it, but I have no idea where it is. And this is a big old planet. So I am going to invest in this, the small vessel, the Nightshade, first. Um, if I was even going to bother getting a CV, I'm not even going to bother getting a CV, to be honest. I'm just going straight Nightshade. <laughs> It's warp capable. <laughs> I don't want to leave. <laughs> All right, that's it. That's it. I mean, I guess I could disassemble the entire thing, but I've claimed it now. It is my base, I suppose. Um, I don't really want it. <laughs> but that's not a bad haul. That's actually a very good haul. One plasma cannon. I wish I had uh, two plasma cannons, but actually, if I find another large plasma drone I might be able to get another plasma cannon it'd just be a case of hunting drones hey look at this thing man this thing is um, two it was at 22 tons 4300 out of 5781 cargo capacity and it moves like a beast these are small thrusters on the back as well that's not bad that's not bad right I'm gonna head back to the base to our little admin base up there. If anything twigs on the uh I beg your pardon. Hey, you know, if you wanted to die, just let me know. I'm gonna head north and then um east. See if we can find anything else light up on the old detector. I don't think so, but you know, if not, it's not the end of the world. Uh what I am gonna do on the way, however, is if I see resource rocks. Um, then I'm going to scoop them up. <laughs> it's not dodgy at all. These, this thing does actually scoop rocks up, doesn't it? Yeah. Please tell me it scoops rocks up. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It's going to take some aiming, though. Alright. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Do you know what, though? It scoops the rocks up, uh, but it doesn't actually put them in the Oh, that's really annoying. It doesn't actually pick them up. <laughs> that's really annoying. I wanted to I wanted to just hoover up rocks off the surface. Ah. 
I don't really need to anymore. I've got everything I need. All I need is like pentaxid. And I think you get pentaxid on the top of mountains. Like, that's just, yeah, that's not going to work for me. <laughs> that's not going to work for me, I'm afraid. Alright, put yourself away. There's a family channel. Right. Yeah, here we go, look. Pentaxid. For days. And I think I can even buy some from the trader. Alright, we are back at the base. Home sweet admin base. Nightshade is six minutes remaining on that clock. We've got a bunch of stuff um, that well, we're not really going to need. We've got a lot of raw pentaxid that we need to refine into regular pentaxid. Uh, into refined pentaxid, indeed. Uh, but also, one of these guys that I set up here, I think this one through here you sir sell refined pentaxid so i will buy oh <laughs> mm -hmm. i will buy as much as i can off of you which is not a lot oh okay we're gonna break the bank hey but you know what that's fine that's absolutely fine because um we've got a ton of stuff we can actually sell in the first place so we got all these weapons the including t2 ones the kits so let's go to town on this stuff right i know that pulse rifle we can sell that the assault rifles he can't but we can sell these kits i think the guy is here you sir master sir sell me this stuff or well, rather buy this stuff off of me And that's it. That got me 26,000. Do you sell anything interesting? No, not really. So how much more refined pentaxid can I buy off of you then, sir? All of it! I can buy it all, and I've still got 3,000 left. Plus uh, the unrefined stuff that I'm now going to turn into the refined. Make me refined pentaxid. Lots of it, as much as you can, good sir smashing this guy can actually build quite a lot of stuff now so that's good I mean look at this kid we got 45 large we got O2 tanks we got five fusion cells from that one POI we're sorted man we are so sorted we are ready to rock and roll as soon as the nightshade is in we're gonna load her up and we're good to go I'm gonna leave good old drifter here um, he did so well actually really good little hover Oh, I'm much better. I need to sort this kind of thing out. I don't know why, again, we've got a, an airtightness issue in the back here. I'm pretty convinced it's a bug, you know, because um, none of this, none of these debug stuff shows a gap. Other than this weird thing going on with this clone chamber, everything in here is sealed. So I think it's a bug. I think it's a bug. I don't know. But uh, yeah, I'll see if I can maybe fix her up a little bit more. Maybe put some nicer deco and stuff on there and maybe publish that one on the workshop as a nice level 5 starter hover vessel um, that's actually upgradable quite nicely because there's two more turret slots on the top here. Um, and with this sort of flat nose and um, space around there, you can add two more Gatlins in there. You can add a drill on the front or a harvester. Yeah. It's quite a, quite an expandable build. Some of you guys were asking as well whether I published this scenario on there so that you guys can have a go. It's not ready yet. Literally, the only thing to this scenario is is these three planets, <laughs> and um, only Magnus is is actually configured in any way. You mirror and Atla aren't. Plus, you know, I need to add a bunch more planets to this thing, and add a, some sort of PDA and I don't know. Yeah, there's a lot to do. So I'm not going to publish it until I've done a bit of work on it. So I'm going to kind of work on that in the background and then hopefully one day I can publish it. Um, but yeah, at the moment, it's literally just this planet. And as you're about to see, uh, you can get off of this planet actually quite easily in the end. So I might need to actually tweak this somewhat a little bit more so it's not so easy. 
he says, after being chased by a patrol vessel and shotgunning everything in the face. Have I turned... I've turned the hover engines off. <laughs> Why isn't it moving? <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, now I need to turn the actual thrusters on so they can manoeuvre. Yeah, that would be good. All right, here we go. Sorry, Mr. Trader, dude. I'm just going to park her here. <laughs> Right, because we make way for the new kid in town, the Mark V Nightshade, and that's just how she rolls <laughs> on our ass. <laughs> Excellent. This is good. This is good. Um, so let's grab. Let's actually fill the Pentaxa tanks up first. Is that everything? That is everything. All right, okay, good. Let's grab then the fusion cells, um, the oxygen, and these Promethean packs from here. I'm going to need, do I need an EVA boost? I'm going out into space. I'm almost certain my heavy armor can take it. Or if not, I've got like a gazillion gold in here somewhere, haven't I? I must put it in the constructor. Let's grab that. Can you make me an EVA boost, please, sir? Yeah, look at this, guys. Look at this pent, man. I'm going to have to put that in the drifter's cargo hold because I can't actually carry it that much. Oh, I've got another Gatlin in there. Ah, oh, sweet. I can upgrade it to four Gatlin straight away. Nice. Excellent. I can now go into the cold dark of space. Smashing. Right. Fill that up completely. That fills it straight up from my connected toolbar. Uh, let's put all this fuel in your fuel tanks. Bingo. Oxygen in your oxygen tanks. Bingo. Now let's see if we can fit two more guns to you. Shouldn't be too difficult. There we go. Maximum armed, four gallons. I like it. That's it, isn't it? Oh my god! I think we're done. I think we can escape. I'm escaping with literally nothing. <laughs> um, I mean, I suppose if I was escaping and then carrying on to play, I'd probably want a lot more stuff in the nightshade's hold here to take with me. In fact, I'd probably continue until I had a CV and could take the Nightshade and the Drifter with me. But, uh, I want off this bloody planet. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> well, it's been fun. Bye-bye, patrol vessel. Yeah, you're not catching me today. It's definitely been an interesting start to the game. Uh, I think I need to tweak it slightly. Maybe tweak the POI so it's less OP or change it entirely. It is a J Randall POI that I just modified, so um, I might see about building a purpose one, a purpose built one, uh, just to make it a little bit more difficult. Um, but there we go. Mission accomplished. I have escaped planet hell. <laughs> So don't forget, guys, that I am starting a new multiplayer Let's Play next week. So I hope you guys can join me for that. It's going to be interesting. It's basically me versus XCal. If you're familiar with XCal, I'll link his channel down below. You should check him out, if not. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's hopefully it's going to be interesting. Uh, we've opened it up to just some, um, some friends, basically. People that uh, we kind of trust to play with and... Uh, gonna play fair so it's not a public server uh, for the time being it's very much closed and invite only just for the sake of the sort of the content and the let's plays between me and xcal and obviously having a nice place to play um, with all of our friends so hope you guys join me for that um, but this is it for this little hello gizmo yes well done thanks for interrupting my recording good work he had to get his word in didn't he I hope you guys have enjoyed this mini Let's Play series um, on this custom planet. Um, thank you very much for watching. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.